Hey there, welcome to Biz Intelligence and in this video we are gonna take a look at how to sort our order columns alphabetically in Power Query. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Now let's go and import some data from another Excel file. Let's go to data tab, click on get data option and here click on from file and from workbook. This is the file that we want to load. Click on import and it will launch Power Query Navigator window where you can make selection of data source. This is the data source that we want to import. Let's click on transform data to launch Power Query Editor window where we can perform data transformation steps on the selected data set. Most of the times we want to order these fields in some orders, especially in alphabetical order. You can see these fields are not sorted in alphabetical order and if you want to order these fields alphabetically then what do we do is we click on the field and we drag it towards left or right and place it at its appropriate place. Now you can see one step is recorded. There is one more option. You can right click on the field, go to move and you can click on left to move this field towards left or you can right click and you can say move to beginning or to end. So this is another way you can move fields from left to right or to beginning or to end. Same option is also available under transform tab. You can go to transform and here you have option called move with same those options. Instead of using this tedious way, we can make a use of choose column option. So I will delete this recorded step and I will go to home tab and under home, let's click on choose columns click on choose columns and it will launch choose column window where you can select fields that you want to retain in the data set that means if you leave any field unchecked that means that field will get deleted so we are not going to make any selection here we will leave it as it is and we will click on this down arrow and we will say sort these fields by their name that means sort these fields alphabetically now there is a small catch which I will show you how it will create some problem. Let's click on OK and you can see new step is recorded which says removed other columns. Instead of reordered columns, it has recorded a step called removed other columns and you can see the code of that step here inside formula bar. It's, it has taken names of all the fields in alphabetical order and said select all these fields in this order. Now there is a small problem that if you add new field in your data set there is a chance that it will miss that field because it says select only these fields in this order. To overcome this issue what we will do is we will go to the beginning of the field. We will go to first field right click here and we will go to move and click on to beginning. Now you can see one more step is recorded which says reordered columns and you can see same code as removed other columns is available for this step as well where we can see all the fields alphabetical order that means they are so sorted in alphabetical order that means this is going to order all these fields in alphabetical order and if any new fields added in the data set it will also get added here at the end of this field list though that won't be ordered alphabetically but there is a list I mean there is no chance of missing any fields. So we will go here and we will make sure that previous step is removed as it will miss it will definitely miss the new field. So we will have to make sure that we remove removed other column step and now our data fields are sorted alphabetically and there is no chance of missing any fields. That's how you can order fields in alphabetical order. If you are new on our channel then subscribe us and visit our channel to watch more such videos. Do not forget to like and share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching.